An old hop. This is the camp. How do we charm her when she's in our care? Do we say what we're after? And here's Eivor. Ah, you timed things well. The Holy Woman Fulke is close by. Imprisoned at St. Albanes Monastery. Just around the bend. This is our moment, Eivor. After this, everything changes. I might be pleased for you if I knew who this woman was and why we needed her. I have explained enough. Now is the time for action. You've done nothing of the sort. Nothing but give me your blind word. I wish to speak to her. Me. Your Jarl. That alone is reason enough. Why? So she might cast a spell and turn Eatman into an eel. Fouke is not the only advantage we seek here, Aver. There will be treasures in St. Albanes. More than we can count. I have already plundered St. Albanes Abbey and lifted its treasures from nave to crypt. I saw no prisoners of note. She is there. I know it. And she is the most valuable treasure of them all. Aver. There was a time when you would follow me without question, because we trusted one another. Because you knew I would never lead you into folly, never wager our lives before I knew the cost. Is there something that holds you back from embracing me as you once did? As your brother? Your family? Sigurd, you know I would never betray you. Y your trust in me. I'll fight with you. But there must be limits to this chase. Gidrich is counting on us. Of course he is. And soon we will deliver. Come. When you raided St. Albanes, are you sure you saw nothing? No crypts? No prisoners? Nothing I can recall for certain. What do we know of this woman? Very little. She appears to be an adventurer of sorts. The Thane called her a heretic. All the better for us. She is clearly someone who knows her own mind. I admire your optimism, brother.
Ote conspecto hominum quale dilex. At long last. Dares enter this sanctuary. This stony cave reeks of piss and salty tears. How dare you! We've come for the woman Fulke. She need not bedevil you any longer. Oh, the mad heretic! Ah, the self-begotten spirit has sent an angel to deliver me. Open the door. Her heresies must be punished. Not by Danes or Mahometans, but by true Christians. Friar. Our hands are bloody with the gore of your guardians. Is your guard so starved of martyrs that you wish to die as well? You make a fine point. Let me pray on this. The Lord bids me to welcome all strangers. Here, friend, take the key and depart with your strange friend. Treasury of Light for this chance of deliverance. Are you sent by the angels of Sacklus, or the self-begotten one above? That I cannot answer. You are the woman called Fulke. I am Fulke in this realm, a humble seeker of the self-begotten one's true nature. And you are a collector of artifacts? The instruments of the children of Sacklus the Fool. Yes, I am. I have many such curiosities. And you possess an object? A polished stone with unusual markings? Now, you're a curious one. A cowl and robes hiding tawny skin. And that devilish blade. Why do we linger here? Soldiers will be coming. There are stables beyond the monastery where we can speak in peace. Lead the way. Come. Some weeks, perhaps a month. For your so-called heresies. Heresies, yes. I... I have many profane objects in my 
lifetime. Objects which attest to the works of the Demiurge. The false god worship... Eivor, stay close. Satis raros sedate, sint piorum ambulare in atris domus dei. Men, they're after us. You there? What's wrong? Here they come! Quick, men, or they'll wipe us out!
Enough of these mysteries, Sigurd. Fulke is a curator of objects of great worth, one of which may reveal my true nature. True nature? You said this was about victory, about defeating Edwin. To know that I am descended from the ancient gods is a victory. It would give me dominion over this land. Descended of the gods? Brother, what by Odin's eye are you saying? Fulke, we have heard that you possess a profane stone with strange markings and the image of a tree. That I do. A monolith I call the Saga Stone, for it came to this land with the Dane Ragnar Lothbrok. Do you have it? It is the sun and moon of all my sacred objects. All this secrecy for a carved stone, Sigurd. To what lengths will you go when you have a real mystery to conceal? Perhaps I should leave you three alone to hammer through your differences? We are unified. We only wish to see the stone, to read the runes inscribed upon it. No one on Earth can read those runes. The language is unknown and probably long dead. There is no risk in letting us look. No risk at all. Praise thee. Oh, self-begotten one, for sending these three to deliver me from my punishment. No whispering god let me hear, Fulke. I brought myself. You came because I called you, Eivor. They spoke through me. Brother, you have my head spinning. And you fascinate me more with each passing moment. The Saga Stone is hidden away in the care of my acolyte. Are you ready to go see it? The sooner we see this slab of rock, the better. Let's go. Approach the stone with an open mind, Ava. You may find it more interesting than you expect. <laughs>